happy friday gang <laughs> i miss y'all i love y'all shout out to my gang i always always got to give it up to y'all first and foremost for just 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 riding with me for loving me for for just just going hard in the paint and them comments about mama magical y'all don't play about me do y'all i love y'all so much <laughs> shout out to my new subscribers welcome to the gang definitely get comfortable subscribe like share all that good stuff um you can reach me at my website for personal readings at www.magicalflowerstarot.com um and for um suggestions or requests regarding the celebrity readings or just some real life shit that we can actually do some with you can definitely <laughs> hit me on my email at magicalflowerstarot at yahoo.com so now that we done got that out the way, Kevin Samuels, oh my gosh. You know, I sat on this for a while. I'm like, should I read on this? Because I seen that that's what y'all was talking about. Y'all wanted to read on that. First and foremost, y'all know I don't play that when somebody first passed away. So I'm not, I will not, am not going to call on his energy. What I will do, because you know, we got, we got integrity in these spiritual streets. At least over here we do. But what I will do is just pick up on some of the... the excuse me, oh Lord, pick up on some of the energy that was surrounding the, the events of um, what happened to him, um, some of the people that were around him, just some of the questions y'all kind of got lingering. I seen some of the stuff that y'all asked me, and I'm not going to specifically ask on those things. Like I said, we got integrity, but hey, the cards don't lie. What's going to come up is what's going to come up, and I always leave y'all room enough to to use your intuition because this is what this is about we all need to cultivate our gifts it ain't about me you know i'm not, i'm special but i ain't you know we all got this so let's just jump into this reading i'm not gonna waste no more y'all time because y'all know excited oh yeah shout out to the ones that's been also coming over to my podcast um i really really appreciate y'all and stay tuned because i'm gonna link the uh link below because i'm definitely going to do a podcast tonight going a little bit deeper into this kevin samuel situation we're gonna talk about the matt gala we're gonna talk about so much stuff y'all so make sure y'all head over to the podcast and i will leave the link in the comments so let's jump into this thing Y'all already know how I do. I'm going to start off by calling on his calling on his name, but I'm not going to try to call on him. Kevin. Oh, also, like I always tell my gang, make sure y'all cover yourselves up. You know, like I always say, put something on your head. If you got some Florida water, put some on the back of your neck. Put some, wipe yourself down with it. Wipe it away. Don't go over the same place twice. Wipe your body downward with it. Put some, like I said, on the back of your neck. Um, if you got some cascaria, some F4, and put some on the back of your neck and your belly button and at the bottom of your feet. So let's get into this. And I don't mean to scare y'all for my newcomers, my new gang members. That's just because whatever I do for myself, I tell my gang to do the same thing. That's all. It's all about protection and love, period. We got to protect our energy. We ain't trying to take nothing with us when we close this thing out. Kevin Samuels, Kevin Samuels, Kevin Samuels. So they said it was a woman with him, y'all. Now, I know that he is married. So we just going to see, you know, what the energy was around that. And I've seen y'all extra questions about what kind of woman, you know, was it and all that. But we're going to see what come out. Spirit, what was the energy around the woman that was with him at his place of residence, at Kevin's place of residence, the night before his transition? Is she suspect? Is there anything that we need to know about her energy? Is there anything we need to know about her? seeing it's a lot of speculation you know people feel like it's fishy it's something more to it they want to know if hollywood got anything to do with it i even seen dr oh my child say something about it so let's see kevin samuels kevin samuels kevin samuels suspect is there anything that she is hiding anything that Okay, I'm sorry, y'all. I seen in the uh, comments, too, y'all was saying my cards wasn't showing. So let me make sure I get these in the camera for y'all. Hopefully, y'all can see them. Hmm. Looked like it was some type of problem, though. Let's see, though. Pentacles. We can't rely on her story. Mm. 
Christmas story is not solid, y'all. Ten of Pentacles, the Empress reverse. Mm, I feel like this is also representing her as well. So, hmm. First and foremost, this is what concerns me, the star reverse. <laughs> the star reverse. I feel like this is picking up on Kevin Samuel's energy. And I also feel like, you know, when I see this five of wands and I see this queen of pentacles and this four of wands, you know, her story is not reliable all the way. She keeping some things back. She definitely keeping some things back. And I feel like there was some type of conflict between the two of them too. So she definitely keeping something back from, you know, the full truth of what happened. Her story is definitely not reliable. That We have the Empress reverse and the Ten of Pentacles. Hmm. I don't know. I feel like some, I feel like, I don't know why I keep feeling something about his wife as well. So I'm really curious to see, you know, what is going to go down with this whole situation. But we can't really believe what she says either. Over it. Hmm. Ten of Pentacles. So, hmm. This is really interesting to me. I'm, I'm hmm. Let's pull some more cards. But yeah, we really can't trust what she said. I almost seem like, sure, she has something to do with this. I ain't even gonna lie. I mean, it is what it is. Let me pull a couple of more just to see. Ace of Cups reverse. Hmm. Red flag. Two of Cups reverse. This is the both of them. Nope. Mm -mm. Something happened between the two of them. So I definitely feel like mm, four of cups. It's definitely more to the story for sure. Her solid. Her, I said her solid. She's not solid. Her <laughs> her situation was not. Um, it was not. It, she what she was saying was not the truth. Basically, four of wands. I feel like this is somebody he could have been messing around with too. Even like behind his wife's back. Did they did they identify this woman? Two of cups. Yeah. Hmm. That's that's. Yeah, it was somebody that looked like he had some extra type of relations with. But we're going to see how deep the rabbit hole goes, y'all. So, the next question. This ain't going to be no long reading either. Because this man just passed away. I'm not trying to sit in that energy. Um, so, the next question is, um, mm, y'all want to know, is there spiritual work involved? <laughs> spirit, was there any type of spiritual manipulation at work? What's the spiritual? Is Holly Weird involved? Someone had it out for him. Because, you know, this man was not liked. We're going to keep it a buck, you know. He was not liked. Uh, a lot of people were saying some harsh things about him. Actually celebrating, you know, him not being here and being passed over. Was there spiritual work involved? Any foul work involved? Mm. Mm. Five of Pentacles. See, a lot of people didn't fuck with him like that. Very cold energy. Making sure we're still in focus. That's that woman, Queen of Wands. Mm. Very much so coldness between the two of them. We've seen that with the Two of Cups reversed. As, as, and I feel like something was definitely playing Two of Wands reversed. And there is some guilt behind this situation. Five of Cups. I feel like they caught this man at a very vulnerable spot. This is her. It was real. Whatever happened, it was very passionate that night, too. They might have even fucked. Sorry, y'all. I'm just saying. But we have a question of boundaries, too. I'm not seeing no magical shit, though. I'm not going to lie, y'all. Y'all know I give it to y'all straight if I'm seeing that. Very, very misfortunate situations, too. I wonder how his money is looking right now. Mm. Might have been some drugs involved, too, y'all. There it go. Hmm. There it is. I don't feel like this is particularly spiritual, though, y'all. I think it's something else. At least I'm not seeing what I want to see to say, yeah, this was some, hmm, this was some spiritual shit. He might have been set up. I feel like I'm getting that, too, especially with them pentacles. So the next question is... Um, why was there such a delay in his passing? I just assumed that people really didn't want to believe that it was true. You know, it reminds me of that girl in New York that passed away. What was her name? Niobe. Ni 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 that loud girl, that Brooklyn girl. Y'all know who I'm talking about. 
nice something like how people didn't want to believe you know because her personality was so big that that actually happened to her but she was you know supposedly pushed out of a window y'all know who i'm talking about comment at, comment below if y'all know who i'm talking about but we're gonna see what was the delay in the news of his passing did the media just want to make sure that the source was reliable They didn't want to be too quick to put that news out. I feel like they also definitely, a part of the media wanted to respect his family, but a part of the media was just really on some F him. I'm not going to lie. King of Cups reversed. They like shit, you know, and, and that's what it is. The Empress reversed. So this is so interesting to me that this Empress reversed keep coming out. Hmm. I do feel like it has something to do with that lady. Ooh. Hmm. Judgment too judgment on the flip side some you know i feel like some some outlets have some integrity they knew that y'all was gonna rip his ass up in the comments you know and it was just a really a vulnerable situation anytime somebody want to pass too so people did want to just make sure before that was just too impulsive with the news to really just come out with that like i said boundaries once again they want to make sure that the you know that the that the reports were first solid enough to come out and confirm something like that. Pentacles, eight of pentacles reversed. Yeah, so they just want to make so it was half and half. A lot of people just want fuck with him like that, and that's just what it is. You know, a lot of people felt like he wasn't a big enough star as well. You know, and a lot of people just really want to respect also his family. They have boundaries, and they feel like they want to make sure first before they put that news out. See that meat? It's like a you know. They just want to put that, that news out first. They want to confirm that before they put that news out. But they knew that y'all was, they knew what y'all was going to do as well. Well, look at this queen of wands. I feel like a woman had, we know that it was a woman there, but I feel like she's playing a bigger role, you know, in the situation that some people might think. Hmm. So speaking of his family, one of the energies around his family, I did not know that he was married with kids. I did not know that. So it was interesting that he was with a woman last night. So let's see. Was it night before last? What is his what is the energy around his family spirit? Do they feel any foul play was involved? Do they feel any suspicion around the situation? Are they paranoid? How are they feeling? Child. Mm. I ain't hold on. Let me pull some more cards. I'm about to say, damn, they look like they kind of happy. <laughs> Ace of Pentacles. Queen of Ooh, some real cold hearted energy, y'all. King of Pentacles. I feel like for some reason they really couldn't rely on him like that. Let me see. I also feel like they feel that somebody was. Mm. His family has, I'm not going to lie, they got some mixed feelings about this man. But they do feel very sorry about the situation. I feel like they feel very eerie about it as well. They do feel like there was some type of suspicion around his, his death. Even if it was him just, you know, out fucking and cheating or whatever he was doing. But they do feel like somebody was surely probably trying to rob him. Like, that was their first initial thoughts. But they feel some some sort of way as well. It's some coldness that he's getting from his family. I almost want to say I feel like they feel like he kind of brought this upon himself, y'all. I'm gonna be real from what I see with this. He has some past some some past issues with his family too. See his mother and a, a wife and child. That's why I'm looking at that. And we already know Six of Cups talks about the past too, especially when it's reversed. Usually it's something that you can't let go of. So he has some issues within his family. I ain't gonna go deep into the man 
you know, business like that because everybody got some shit, you know. But hmm, it's, it's crazy to see these mixed emotions with his family. High priestess. Hmm. Look at that. They feel like it's deeper than what people think it is. Hmm. It's a lot of back and forth between his family. Ace of Cups. See, I told you some of them feeling really cold towards this man. It felt like he almost had no business doing what he was doing. He was keeping something from them. Not to say like they don't care and they're happy. But you see this four of wands. This represents marriage. It's reversed in the home. It's reversed. There was some, you know, some disharmony in that situation. Especially between him and his wife. Okay, so, um... <laughs> Y'all want to know, uh, why was he so nice to Miss Nicki Minaj when she came on the show? Because she's Nicki. That's what I was thinking. Ooh, what's this? Mmm, paranoid. Holly weird. Mmm. See, they felt like, I feel like this is how his family was feeling. And, you know, also, when I think about the high reform reverse, you know, y'all, I like to call this Holly weird, depending on what we're talking about. But I really don't feel no magic like that. I really don't feel like it's that situation. When I look at this, the basic meaning of this card, the hierophant, like I told you guys before, the traditional meaning is morals, tradition, culture, your upbringing, religion in the house, you know, just the, the that part of the family, how we were raised up in the home and our beliefs and the morals we stand on in this family. So when it's reversed, this can also mean like an unconventional situation in the home or somebody that just broke all the rules, went against the home, went against your morals, went, went against everything that we stood for. And this is some deep grief on someone's behalf. I just don't know. I feel like y'all say he was married, so this might be his wife. And I feel like this might have been him too. I feel like he suffered some for some some deep some deep depression. Um, who mentally, yeah, he wasn't all what he made himself seem to be on the camera. I'll tell y'all that. So y'all want to know what was the energy around him and Nicki, him and Nicki Minaj? I mean, what what was he really gonna say about Nicki Minaj? <laughs> I mean, I guess it was some stuff he could have said if he wanted to, but. Let's see, why was he so nice to Nikki when she came on the show? Two of Cups. Mm. Queen of Cups. He didn't want to fuck up with Nikki Minaj. She knew that Nicki Minaj to me was not his on his level. She wasn't equal to him. She wasn't one of those that he can talk down on like that because obviously she got more money than him. Not that money is everything, but that's kind of the stuff that he will put women against. Like I didn't watch his shows, but from what I seen, he judged your financial status, the way you look. And, you know, as far as that, Nicki had all of that. And it's like, what what is he really going to say with her? And I think he was just happy that she was there. Seven of Cups. <laughs> He felt like he was making waves, you know, the Hermit reverse. He was really, I feel like this talking about him being more loose with her, you know, not being so stuck in that, that type of energy. Oh, I'm going to tell you about yourself. Mm -mm. Not with her, King of Pentacles reverse. He didn't want to lose out. Shoot, he was hoping to have more people on that level, you know, con connect with him and come and be on his, on his show or whatever you want to call it, platform content, whatever, Ace of Cups reverse. But yeah, hmm. he knew that Nikki was not going to play with him, first and foremost. The moon. Mm. I feel like he liked the Nikki's energy, too. I don't know. I don't know why I think that when I see the moon. I feel like he liked the energy that she had. Because, you know, Nikki, sometimes she can really have, like, that laid-back and calm demeanor. But I didn't see the show, so how was she... I, I seen, like, a clip of it, but she didn't seem like she was really... I don't know. I, I got to watch it, but somehow he liked her being there. The moon energy, he felt comfort with her. He didn't feel like it was, he didn't have to be as serious as he normally does, especially with that hermit reverse. So he was able to kind of loosen up a little bit for some reason. And because he was probably struck in star status, especially starstruck with that seven of cups energy. 
shit. Opportunities. Opportunities. He didn't want to mess up with someone on that caliber who can open up more doors for him. He didn't want no bad blood, in other words. So, <laughs> okay, so this is a really good question. Y'all wanted to know, was he genuinely there for the black community? What was his true objective, his true intentions for his critique and his somewhat abrasive criticism? What was the true energy spirit? What was his intention with all of this? Was he really trying to tear black women down? Or was he just trying to give them a harsh perspective of reality so maybe they can tweak some things? to uplift the black community by way of his criticism. What's that true? He has some painful shit in his past, y'all. He wasn't like that just to be no... At, he went through some six, six of swords, some painful situations. It's There it go. I knew it. Three of swords reversed. There it go. But betrayal. He has some issues, I feel like, with women. See these two women? Nine of Pentacles. And he also found fame in quote unquote in doing what he was doing. He was getting paid, trust me. King of Pentacles reversed. But the way that he was getting paid, some would say was just the wrong way. Trying to get inf almost infamous. You're known for being bad, being mean, being harsh, whatever you want to say, King of Pentacles. But he was paying him. Six of some from his past. I knew it, y'all. I told y'all. Ooh, my cards be getting stuck. Eight of Wands. The Hermit. This is him on his the computer. People looking at him. He was able to really come out of his shell on that platform. He was really able. It was almost like therapeutic for him when he would get on there and talk to women and tell them how he really felt and what they looked like. Eight of Swords reversed. So, yeah, I told y'all, he has some really deep mental issues. I'm not going to lie about the shit. Um, Eight of Swords, I feel like this is representing that negative talk that he was saying, not only to himself, but to the women that he was speaking to. But at the end of the day, let me say this, y'all, because I ain't trying to judge either way, but were y'all, was these women, like, paid to call his show? Like, why? The thing that I didn't understand is, like, why is y'all calling this man? Like, y'all know how he gonna give it to you. It's like, you know, like I told somebody earlier, it's like going into the doctor office, you getting your, he, the doctor coming in the room, and you saying, give it to me straight, doc. You can't get mad when the doctor say, oh, you got cancer. You got six months to live. You better live your life. Kiss everybody goodbye, because your ass is finna go. You know, you, you said give it to me straight. So, like I said, I didn't watch like that. So, I could be wrong. I stand corrected if I'm wrong. But it's like, y'all knew what y'all... was. It, it seems like that the woman knew how he was going to critique them before they dialed his number. Knight of Cups. But in some real way, it seemed like he did try to... Hmm, Knight of Cups. <laughs> in some sick and twisted way, he did feel like he was he was contributing. He was helping. That was just his way, I guess, of showing... Harsh love, I guess. But yeah, but a lot of this was like, he he was betrayed. He was fucked up by women in the past. I, that's what I'm seeing. With the Six of Cups reversed as well. But shit, at the end of the day, we gotta be real. It paid. His ways paid. It got him, it got him talked about. You know, in a, in a weird way, it got, it made more women want to come on his show to get critiqued and criticized. But hey, don't make it right, King of Pentacles reverse. I mean, like they say, you know, when does morals and integrity and stuff like that come to play? You know, all money, is it really good money? Is money just money, no matter how you get it? King of Pentacles reverse. So the next question, and the final question, because like I said, he just passed, so I'm not going to pull no shadow cards, and I ain't trying to... You know, he needs to, his spirit needs to do what it needs to do. So, we ain't going to get into all of that. So, what is the overall energy around his death spirit? Show us the overall energy surrounding his death. Some of that for our spirit. What is the overall energy circumstances surrounding his death? Six of Cups 
This is so interesting. <laughs> that woman who just went and the pizza. Sorry, y'all. My cars be getting stuck. The stop on me. Somebody want to stop him. Justice reverse. We probably ain't never gonna get the truth because it's manipulation around it. Boundaries. For a wine. See, somebody had an issue with him from the past. See, this one no magical shit. I feel like this was vengeful type of energy. The story is manipulated for sure. It's probably really not going to come out the real truth. And I feel like I see karma when I see justice reversed. Some look from the past. See, he had some bad blood with somebody. Y'all, I'm not going to lie. This shit was playing. It looks like it. And they just wasn't feeling what he was doing. They didn't like his energy. Just don't feel like they weren't feeling the work he was put out too. To a pentacles reverse. I feel like he was trying to juggle two different lives too. When I see this two of pentacles reverse, it keeps coming. So I feel like that. But yeah, see, somebody was trying to put a stop to that ass, and they was pissed and they was standing on this. This is about boundaries. They was not feeling him. Six of wands. And I feel like that night, of course, there was passion. There was sex as well. But this is him. They had to take him out. Just for one more. The fool again. Hmm. The chariot. See how this keep coming out? I hate to say the wife maybe has something to do with this too. See, so that lady was in, she was in cahoots with somebody. And they said, we gonna do this shit. I mean, that's just what the car is saying, y'all. This is what I'm picking up. So let me know how y'all felt about this reading. But at the end of the day, we are not judging nobody. Him today, you tomorrow. I mean, that's just how it is. That's why we got to make sure that we are not exuding some type of energy out there. Like, we glad somebody, you know, hey, when spirit speaking, when spirit step in and regulate shit, you know, what you putting out, you will get back. So, I'm going to let y'all take that how y'all want to take that. I love y'all so much. Once again, you can definitely reach me at for personal readings at www.magicalflowersterot.com. If you want to comment, please comment below. I will link my podcast below. Also, for those who have any more suggestions on the YouTube readings, definitely hit me up at magicalflowersterot at yahoo.com. Love y'all family. Till next time. Peace.